It's Friday, March 14th. Hello, I'm Chris Lechuga. We're here at the Don Haskins Center for Conference USA, and here's what you need to know about what's happening at the University of Texas at El Paso. UTEP economics professor Tom Fullerton has secured several external research grants that are part of the Border Region Modeling Project. He is working with research associate Adam Walkey and a group of student researchers on the two-year $116,000 project that will examine the commonalities of water usage among municipal water utilities around the world. 2014 is not only UTEP's centennial year, but also commemorates 10 years since Disney began filming the movie Glory Road. One decade ago, the story of our 1966 Texas Western team came back to life when filming began right here at the UTEP campus. I'm very pleased that you're interested in the coaching job, Mr. Haskins. We're a small college. You'd have to live in the men's dorm with your family. How's it sound? Yeah, that's what it takes to coach Division I basketball. <laughs> That's all right with me. As the movie depicts, late UTEP coach Don Haskins selected the first all-African-American team to defeat an all-white Kentucky team to win the 1966 NCAA Men's Basketball Championship. That game will go down in history as a turning point in collegiate athletics and pave the way for African-American athletes throughout the nation. Pat Riley stands defectively looking at the floor as Kentucky has lost the championship game for the first time in their history. Speaking of championship basketball, teams of fans from across the nation arrived in El Paso earlier this week to officially kick off March Madness. UTEP is hosting the 2014 Conference USA Men's and Women's Basketball Championships right here in the Don Haskins Center. This is the second time the university has hosted the tournament, the first time was back in 2011. Having the tournament back at UTEP not only re impacts the regional economy, but also serves as an opportunity to showcase our beautiful campus. Save the date, Minor Nation, UTEP will be hosting a huge open house event full of fun activities to showcase our campus, programs, and students. Visitors can attend workshops, concerts, and exhibits, as well as tour classrooms, laboratories, student recreation areas, and athletic venues. Also, the documentary, UTEP, The First 100 Years, by Hollywood producer and UTEP Distinguished Alumnus, Hank Cohen, will premiere on Saturday, April 12th at the Centennial Museum. The open house is part of UTEP's ongoing centennial celebration. For more information about these and other stories, check out utepnews.com. I'm Chris Lechuga. We'll see you next Friday. Go Miners!